Hello. Hello, good evening. Hello, Guadalupe. Hello, Mirna. How are you? Welcome to all the ones that are connecting. Welcome to the class. Hello, 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 and hello. Good evening. Good evening. It's a pleasure to have you here. Thank you. What a happiness to have you in another class. Okay. Good afternoon. Hello, good evening. How are you? It is a pleasure to have you here. It's a pleasure to have you in class. Well, my dear students, today we are going to continue working on the topic that we started yesterday. And for sure, we are going to work a little bit on sentences in affirmative, negative, and interrogative with going to. So it's a big, big happiness to have you all here. How was your day? How good was evening. It? Hello, good evening. How was your day? It was nice. It was nice. Fine, fine. It was fine. How was your day? Very busy. Very busy. Good. What about the rest? How was your day? Know. It was very well. Good. What else? It was nice, good, so so, right? Remember, people, that the cameras are very important. So I can see that you are actually here in the class. Thank you, Mirna. Thank you, uh, Guadalupe. Thank you, Lisette. Thank you, Marisol, Beatriz, Abigail, that I can see your cameras, but I cannot see, well, I saw Roberto a couple of seconds ago, Jorgito, I cannot see your camera, Juanita, Javier, Rafael, David, Catherine, right? I cannot see your cameras. Can you please help me with that? Thank you very much. Well, today we are going to start working a little bit on a, a very short activity, right? We're going to do a very short activity first, and then we are going to start with our practice from yesterday, right? Yesterday, we started a practice about uh, going to, right? And the sentences. Today, we are going to do some practice about the topic as well. So, I am going to share my screen. So we can see it, okay? Here we go. Let me see if you can see my screen. Here it is. We are going to start today with this short practice. Do you identify what this is? Can you identify? Un trabalenguas. Exactly. Un trabalenguas. How do you say that in English? A tongue twister. Tongue twister. I am going to write it for you here. This is a tongue twister. A tongue twister, right? It's a tongue twister. It's un trabalenguas, right? And it says, a good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. <laughs> this is the baby level, okay? A good cook. Baby, please. A good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Okay. <laughs> it says a good cook. Cook is on chef, right? A good cook. This word, for example, the one that you have right here, this one, it's could with D at the end, could, could. Practiquenla conmigo, could. Could, 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 It's okay. O ya le, le vive cenar a la niña, pues. <laughs> Tengo hambre, mamá. A good cook 
could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cookies who could cook cookies <laughs> who could cook cookies yeah hasta lo hasta todo nos pasa could cook cookies okay a good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies okay cookies practice 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 with your microphone off. Practíquenlo ahí con el micrófono apagado. And then we are going to do it with the open microphone, okay? Right now, practice with your open microphone. Go ahead. Okay, practice, practice, practice. Practice, please, thank you. A good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Okay, it's fine. Okay, Jorge, are you ready? A good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook Cookie. Very good job. You did it nice. Yay. Reactions for Jorge. Very good job. Very good job, right? Reactions for Jorge. Very nice. You did a very nice job. Little by little, right? Ta, 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 right? Let's see. Another volunteer. ¿Quién más? Vamos a ver. ¿Quién más asume el reto del tongue twister? Mr. Roberto, go ahead. Then Wendy, good. A good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Very good job. Nice, nice. Wendy, go ahead. Okay. A good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Very nice. Yay, Wendy, Wendy. Guadalupe. Okay, a good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Hey, fantastic pronunciation! Very good job. Good, Eric. A good cook who cook as much cookies as a good cook who who cook. Cookies. Very good. Excellent job. Start for all of you. Another volunteer. I want another volunteer. Okay, another one. Another volunteer. Yo. Go ahead. A good cook could cook as much cookies. Cookies as in good cook who could cook. Cookies. Very good. Very good job. <laughs> nice. You did it. Very good. Yeah. A muchos estudiantes les da miedo. Dice, I know I cannot do it. No, 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 no. But I like your attitude. It's like, I can do it. I can do it. That's good. That's good. One more. One more. Tatiana. Okay. And Ana Ruth. And Mirna. Good. <laughs> A good cook could could has much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Yeah, hey, good. We're right. good. Could cook. Could cook cookies. Could cook cookies. Good job. Good job. Good job. Mirna. Okay. A good cook could cook as much cookies as good could cook could cook cookies. Okay. Let, let's do it again. A good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Okay, Mirna, vamos. Next try. Segundo okay. round. A good cook could cook as much cookies as good cook could cook good cookies. Very good. You see, you did a very good job. Fantastic exercise. Very nice. And my last volunteer, Who's my last volunteer? ¿Quién es mi último voluntario? My last volunteer, Ana Ruth. Okay, Ana Ruth and Brian. Go, go, okay. Go. A good cook who cool, cook as much cookies. As a good cook who cool, cool, cook cookies. Very nice, Ana Ruth. Nice pronunciation. Beautiful. Brian, let's talk. Let's do it. A good cook, a good cook 
co cook has much cookies, has a good cook who could cook cookies. Cookies, very good job. Brian, Francisco, Anna mm -hmm. Ruth, and all of you. And I know all the group is doing a good practice and you are doing a very good job. Nice. The tongue twisters, you might say, I teach it, but why? Why are you making us read that? They help a lot with fluency. They help a lot with fluency. They help with pronunciation. They help with confidence, right? So they help in many, many different aspects, right? It helps a lot. Los tongue twisters, los trabalenguas in English, they help a lot with your fluency. Puede parecer un chiste, un jueguito, and everything, but they help you with your fluency. So you say, a good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cookies. Okay, so it helps to develop fluency. And it is good. If you look for them on the internet, practice, listen to them, and everything, right? This was a baby tongue twister. Let's go with another one. <laughs> that was the baby level okay it's a level baby baby level expert <laughs> you can do it i know it says how much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood he would chuck, he would, as much as he could, as chuck, as much wood, as a woodchuck would, if a woodchuck could chuck wood. What <laughs> so I was like, what? Wood, wood. How much wood, how much wood, okay, cuando tenemos las dos O juntas, suena como una U, okay, how much wood, would a woodchuck chuck, if a woodchuck could chuck wood, right? If he, he would chuck, he would as much as he could and chuck as much wood as a woodchuck would. If a woodchuck could chuck wood, okay? It is not really complicated, right? I am going to leave you this one. Se lo voy a enviar al chat. For you to practice today, tomorrow, or during the day, so you can have it, right? So you can practice this one for tomorrow. Okay. So let me send it here. And here, I am going to send it to you. There you go. So you can practice on the day. And you can do it. I think it's okay like this. Okay. It's on the WhatsApp group. It's going to be there for you to practice. Ahí se los dejo para que practiquen para mañana. Good exercise. Good exercise. About the cookies, it was easy. It was easy and friendly. Eso estuvo bonito. Nice and friendly. So, let's go back here. My dear class, yesterday we were talking about the sentences with going to, right? So, remember that uh, these type of sentences are built up by the subject, the verb to be, we have it right here. The subject, the verb to be, going to, and the normal verb, okay? Algunos estaban preguntando de los ejercicios en la plataforma. And it's the structure, right? Esta era la estructura. The subject, the verb to be, going to, and the normal verb. So, we were creating sentences yesterday. And in order to create, for example, negative sentences, you use not after the verb to be, okay? To make it negative, you put not after the verb to be. And you will say, teacher, but how do you make a question, right? How would you make this one in an affirmative form? ¿Cómo haríamos esta en afirmativo? She is not going to cook dinner. How would you make it affirmative? ¿Cómo lo hacemos afirmativo? She is going to cook she dinner. She is going to cook dinner. She is going to cook dinner, right? You say she is going to cook dinner. Okay, in the period. 
How would you make it a question? ¿Cómo le hacemos pregunta? Is she going, is she going, to, going to cook going dinner? Is she, is she going, going, to going to cook dinner? Is she going, going to cook, cook, cook dinner? Right? There you have it. Is she going to cook dinner? She is going to cook dinner and she is not going to cook dinner. So here you have the three forms of the sentences. And the change is going to be only in the verb to be. Si cambiamos el sujeto, for sure you're going to change the verb to be. If we have I, so you say I am going, they are going, right? You change the subject. So for this one, here we have a little bit more examples for the questions, right? Is she going to cook dinner? Then you can have more examples. Are you going to study? Are you going to study? Is he going to play, right? Is he going to play? And then you can create more and more examples depending on the subject that you have. Here you have three forms of questions, right? What is the first example question? ¿Cuál es la primera pregunta de ejemplo que tenemos? What is the first one? Are you going... Are you, going, Are you to going to do anything this weekend? Are you going to do anything this weekend? And you have two forms of questions because this one is a close question, right? Si tenemos, are you, is he, is she, and everything, it's a close question. Son preguntas cerradas. What is the option to answer? Yes or no, okay? We can answer yes or no. Are you going to do anything this weekend? Yes, I am. No, I am not. You can give me extra information later. If you say, yes, I am. I am going to celebrate my birth. No, I am not. I am going to stay home, okay? But the most important part is the first section of yes or no. Imagine that I say, are you going to take a shower after the class? Are you going to take a shower after the class? Yes, I am. I am. Yes. yes, I am. Mm -hmm. And you say, no, I am not, right? Tal vez a usted no le gusta. And you say, I'm not, teacher. No, I am not. Then say, are you going to eat after the class? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. yes teacher. <laughs> are you going to are you going to drink water after the class? Yes, yes I am. Yes, I am. Are you going to drink water? Are you yes, going to check social media after the class? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. <laughs> Are you going to drive after the class? No, 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 no I'm not. not. Right, no. Josue? Yes, I am. You <laughs> see? Yes, I am driving right now. Okay. Are you going to work after the class? No, yes, I am. No, no. Yes, I am. <laughs> yes, I am. Online. Online. Online work, right? That's so sad. Are you going to clean the house after the class? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. No, I am. No. Are you going to watch TV after the class? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I, am. I imagine you watching TV, eating, drinking water, and checking. Yes, social. I am. <laughs> That's me. That's me, right? Me going out of the shower, right? Salita de la, de la ducha with social media, with the food and the water and the TV. Yeah, that's everything that I am going to do after the class. So these are the two forms of answer. Yes, I am. No, I am not. Because you have closed question. But if I say, for example, in this case, to make it more like more detailed. Ooh, what a big letter that I have. Let me make it smaller. Okay, I think it's going to be 24. Here, if I ask you, what are you going to do later? Okay, this is not a closed question, right? Esta ya no sería una pregunta cerrada. This is an open question because I am asking you what? And then you have to give me information. These are information questions, okay? 
are you, is she, is he? These are closed questions, yes or no? What, where, how, why? Those are information questions because you need to give me details, right? If I come and say, Guadalupe, what are you going to do later? What are you going to do later? ¿Qué vas a hacer más tarde? Um, I am going to watch TV. I am going to watch TV, right? You need information. Aquí no me puede decir yes. No. <laughs> because imagine if you say, what are you going to do later? Yes. ¿Qué vas a hacer más tarde? Sí. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's not logical, right? So that's why you need extra information. What are you going to do later? I am going to watch TV. I am going to eat. I am going to sleep. I am going to send messages anything right but in this case we have yes no questions is kayla going to have a party for you yes she is no she isn't are the waiters going to sing to you yes they are no they aren't right if you go and celebrate your birthday in a restaurant are the waiters going to sing yes or no and after the yes and no you can give me more information if I say, for example, eh, let's see, people in general, este para todos. are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? Are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? No, 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 I, no, no. no I'm not. Ah, then you can give me more information. Okay, después me pueden dar datos. And you say, no, I am not, teacher. I am going to work. No, teacher, I am not. I don't have money. No, teacher, I am not. I am going to visit my mother. Okay? So, think on your, on your information. Piensen en los datos extra que me van a dar. So, I am going to start with uh, Wendy Lisette. Are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? No, I am not. I am at work in the house. I am going to work. I am going house. to work in the house. I am going to work in the house. Diego, uh, David Rafael, are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? No, I am not because I don't have money. <laughs> because <laughs> I don't have money, right? I am going to save money, right? ¿Cuál es la excusa que damos para no decir que no tenemos pisto? I, I want to save money. Quiero guardar un poco de dinero. I, I am going to save money, okay? I, I don't like estoy, the beach. Estoy a dieta. <laughs> I, I don't really like the beach, did you? <laughs> so, good. Let's see. Ana Isela, are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? No, I'm not. I'm going to spend with my family. I'm going to spend time with my family. I am going to spend time with my family. Cynthia, are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? No, I'm not. I'm going to clean house. I'm going to clean the house, right? Yeah, very dedicated people. Guadalupe, are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? No, I'm not. I'm going to visit my sister-in-law. I am going to visit my sister-in-law. Jorge, are you going to go to the beach on Saturday? No, I'm not. I'm going to stay home. I'm going to stay at home, right? Very honest students. I love you. <laughs> I am going to stay home, teacher. Don't, I don't like the beach, teacher. No, too hot. Teacher. <laughs> yeah, excuses, excuses, you say. Good, very good. So here we go. I need you please to tell me three affirmative sentence, three negative sentences, and three questions with going to. Create on your notebook three affirmative sentences, Three negative sentences and three questions. Teacher, one question. Yes. Eh, digamos, ¿en qué momento puedo utilizar going to o wanna? No oh, sé. okay, okay, okay. Good question. Gonna. Sí. Sí. Gonna, it's only for speaking. Okay, gonna, it's only for speaking and in very informal events. Okay. Por ejemplo, en una situación formal, no vas a decir gonna. I'm gonna go. No, puedo ocuparlo solamente en speaking y en situaciones informales, con amigos, conocidos, but not in a formal situation. And not for writing. No lo podemos usar en la forma escrita. Sí se usa en, en textos, en chats, right? That you say, I'm gonna go. Like this, right? 
but it's not something appropriate for writing. It's just for speaking. Esto es más que todo para una contracción en speaking. Pero nunca lo usamos en cuestiones formales, documentos, cuestiones educativas. So, because it's informal, right? So you say, I am going to. It's better. I am going to go. That's the use of this. Okay, Eric, okay. did I answer your question? ¿Te respondí tu pregunta? Sí, sí, claro. Okay. Muchas gracias. Good, very good job. Okay, and you can use it with gonna and also with wanna. I want to do it, you say. I want to do it. I want to do it. Okay, so this is another one. Es, casi siempre lo usamos en, en la forma de speaking para cuestiones informales con amigos y para hacerlo más rápido. I'm going to go, you say. I'm going to go. I want to go. I want to go. Want to go y la otra sería como la contracción, como la fueron la manera informal. La manera informal contractada solo en cuando estás hablando. I'm going to go. Okay. Yeah. Y significa okay. lo mismo. I'm going to go. I want to go. Right? But it's faster. Es como para hablar un poco más rápido, dicen. Pero es, siempre sigue siendo informal. So, that's the use. Okay, entendido. Three affirmatives, three negatives, and three questions, okay? Go ahead. Okay, continue writing the sentences. Continue writing. Okay, three affirmatives, three negatives, and three interrogatives. Pueden ser con I, you, we, she, he, they, any. Remember to use the structure, okay? Ok, denme un segundo, pongo a cargar mi compu. Ya vuelvo. Terminen las oraciones para mientras. Voy a poner a cargar mi compu. your questions, your sentences. Yes. Remember to follow the structure, right? I am going to, he is going to, right? Follow the, the structure. Okay. So we're going to share. We're going to share in groups because I want all of you to practice, right? I want all of you to practice. We're going to have five groups, okay? And I need you to share your sentences, okay? In the groups, I need you please to tell your sentences to your friends. Your three affirmatives, your negatives, and your interrogatives, okay? Vamos a compartir con nuestros compañeros las oraciones en los grupos, okay? So, there you go. You are going to be in groups of five, okay? okay. You are going to be in groups of five. Accept my invitation to go to the groups, please. And here we go.
Thank you. Josue, did you receive my invitation to go to the groups? Thank you very much. So now that all of you are in the groups, we are going to listen to what they are sharing. Let's go to the groups to see how they are doing. Hello, Juanita. Le digo mi invitación para ir a los grupos. No. Juanita, le llegó mi invitación para ir a los grupos. Hola, Juanita. Me escucha. Hola, Juanita. Very good. Now let's see. Let's go to see how they are doing. Did you finish? Did you finish? Terminaron de compartir. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, teacher, oh, that's what we were supposed to be doing. Huh? Did you finish sharing? Tienen que compartir sus oraciones, sus tres afirmativas, sus tres negativas, sus tres preguntas. Okay. I need you to read them. I need you to read them. Listo que las lean. Okay. I need you to read the three sentences, affirmative, negative, and interrogative. Uh -huh. Cynthia, what are your sentences? Okay, the first, I'm going to study all morning tomorrow. Very good. He's going, he's going to play tennis on Friday. They are going to cook a big cake. Okay. Negative. I'm not going to swim. Okay. He's not going, he is not going to read that book. Okay. They are not going to celebrate her birthday. Birthday. Sí. Is she going to dance with you? Very good. So the uh, rest, I need you to continue. Okay, good, Cynthia. Continue, but I need the other ones to share. Necesito los otros que también compartan sus oraciones. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Mm. Uh -huh. Did you finish sharing? ¿Terminaron de compartir sus oraciones? No. Eh, Teacher, no. yo no he podido porque es que como en mi trabajo estoy me quedé. Okay. Entonces, aquí estoy solo yendo. Okay, Diarita. What about the other ones? Laura, Catherine, Oscar. Yo le estoy escribiendo ahorita. Okay, she's going to class oh. with him. She's... No sé si son así. It's okay. She's going to class with him. She's going to go to class. She's going to go to class. Okay, let's see. Uh, he's going to eat. I will, okay, in this case, I will going, no podemos ocupar los dos juntos, right? I am going to sleep now, right? You do not watch TV. You are not going to watch TV, Catherine. No faltó el going to. You are not going to watch TV, okay? Let's fix it. Remember to use the going to form, okay? So, continue. I am going to come back in a moment. Sigan, ya vuelvo. Okay. 
weekend. Very good, very yeah. good. What are you going to do next weekend? Good sentence. Did you finish sharing? Ya terminaron de compartirlas todas? Yeah. Okay, perfect. <laughs> We're going to go back in a moment then. You can okay. continue creating more, but I am going to take you back. I'm missing one group. Solo un grupo me falta. Ya vuelvo. ¿Ah? Entonces siempre. Yes. Y en, las negativas sería, en las negativas sería no going to. Ajá. No going to. Exacto. Pero siempre agregando, siempre agregando el going to. Yes. <laughs> Así okay. es. Very good job. You are doing a good job. Okay, did you finish sharing? ¿Terminaron de compartir? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Let's go back to the main room then. Okay. Okay. So, I am going to bring everybody back. Okay, voy a traerme a todos de vuelta. Good. Ajá. Sentences, affirmative, negative, and interrogatives. I need you to ask questions. A ver, pregunte. Are you, teacher, are you? Questions, questions, questions. For the teacher. Teacher, are you? Teacher, are you I going to eat your dry dinner? Okay, are you going to eat your dinner? Yes, after the class. <laughs> Mirna? Okay, teacher, are you going to drive to work? No, I am not going to drive. My husband is going to drive. What about okay. the next one? Okay, another question. Levantamos la manita, ya sea en cámara o en la presentation question. Are they going to go to the beach? Good, Jorge. Is he going to clean a car? Okay, good. Good questions. Uh -huh. Question me. Pregúntenme. Go ahead. Are you going... Let's see, I have here. Teacher, are you going to sleep? Yes, at 11. I am going to sleep. Questions. Teacher, are you going to... Questions, questions, questions. Teacher, are you going to see you tomorrow? Are you going to see you tomorrow? Yes, we are going to see me tomorrow. Sí, mañana me van a ver. <laughs> because... Uh, Teacher. Yes? Are you going to eat pupusas? I am going to eat pupusas for breakfast tomorrow. Yeah, <laughs> people, that's important. That's a good question. Tomorrow, it's a normal day. I am going to be here with you, okay? ¿Cómo, ¿Qué mejor manera de conmemorar nuestro día que teaching? <laughs> For sure. So tomorrow we have normal classes. Don't worry, right? Tomorrow we have normal classes. For Teacher's Day. That's so nice. I, I'm very happy, right? Yeah. Un día sin aprender es un día perdido. Así que we need to practice. <laughs> so let's go back here and... Oh, Jorgito and Juanita, they are, you're having issues with your microphone. Ay, that's a very difficult thing. Okay, cuando les falle de repente el audio, traten de quitar los audífonos, traten de dejarlos así, este, solo con el audio del, del, del device que están ocupando y, este, y traten de mantener el micrófono en silencio para que no tengan feedback, porque si no tienen un rebote de sonido un poco fuerte. So, let's go back here. Okay, I have a lot of questions, but I need you to pay attention to them because I need you to choose one of them to answer. We are going to use these ones for the audio tomorrow, okay? What are you going to do after class? What time are you going to go to bed tonight? What time are you going to get up tomorrow morning? What are you going to do tomorrow morning? What are you going to do tomorrow afternoon? What are you going to do tomorrow night? What are you going to watch on TV tonight? How are you going to get home from school after class? And what are you going to eat for dinner tonight? Okay, I am going to send you the different questions. So you are going to have the chance to practice your answers, okay? Se las voy a enviar para que tengan la oportunidad de practicar sus respuestas. You have them on the WhatsApp chat. I need you to write your answers in detail, right? 
write detailed answers for these different questions. You are going to use them tomorrow, okay? Esta la vamos a usar el día de mañana. So please write the answers, okay? Choose, if you want to answer all of them, perfect, okay? Las pueden contestar todas in detail, okay? These are for tomorrow. I send them to you on WhatsApp, okay? So let's go with the ones that are on the pictures and I am going to make the pictures bigger. Okay, I am going to make this one. I'm going to erase that one and I'm going to make this one bigger. So tell me about the pictures that you have here. What are they going to do? Number one, what are they going to do? Catherine? Uh, they are, they are going to dance. Uh, a question. Teacher. Yes, Catherine. Eh, las preguntas se las podemos, o sea, las podemos hacer en el cuaderno y mandarle foto. Yeah, you can do it. You are going to use... No, 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 it's okay. You can answer the questions. You can answer the questions because you are going to use them in class. La vamos a ocupar en clase para discusión. Okay. So I need you to answer them. Necesito que las respondan porque las vamos a ocupar en clase. If you want me to check it, that's perfect. Si quieren que se las revise, me las pueden enviar en, en el cuaderno, una imagen, un mensaje de WhatsApp. It's okay. Okay, thank you. If you want to do a PDF, perfect. You can send it. But you are going to use it in class. La vamos a usar en la clase. Okay? PDF. Yep. PDF. So, let's go here. Number one, they are going to? They are going dancing. to dancing. Dancing. They are going to dancing. Podemos decir eso? Después de tú poner un ING. They are going to dancing or no. they are going to dance? No. no. They are going to dance. Dance, a dance. normal verb, right? We use a normal verb. They are going to dance. Yeah. What about number two? Read. She is going to read. She is going to read. Going to read. read. She is going to read. Number three. She is going to swim. Number four. She is going to run. She is going to run. Walk, run. Number five. They are going to have dinner. They are going to eat. Uh -huh. Okay. They, they are going uh, to have dinner. Number five. Breakfast. Okay, right. They are going to uh, going to watch uh, television. Watch it's, it's, it's it's breakfast, right? Maybe in Australia. It's at night. Number six. <laughs> he is going to watch TV. Right. He is going to watch TV. Number seven. They are going to the cinema. They are going to the cinema. Very good job. And what about number eight? <laughs> he is going to work. Okay. To so work. follow the exercise. Okay. Pongan atención al ejercicio. I am going to dance. I am not going to read. Another example. I am going to go to the movies. I am not going to watch TV. Another example. I am going to exercise. I am not going to eat. Another example. I am going to swim. I am not going to work. Raise your hand and give me examples. Levanten su manita y me dan ejemplos. Ana Ruth. I'm going to dance. I am not going to swim. I am not going to? To swim. Very good. Nice, you got it. More examples. I'm going to the park and I'm not uh, going to the university. Okay, I'm going to the park. I am not going to the university, okay? Vamos más allá. Excellent. Wendy Lisette. I am going to go cinema. I'm going to go to the cinema. I am not going to work. I am not going to work. Very <laughs> good. <laughs> nice. Mirna. She is going to read. 
She's not going to swim. Very good. More examples. Vamos. Aprovechen la oportunidad. Practiquen. Participen. Go ahead. Eric. I am going to drive. I am not going to room. Very good. I am not going to run. Excellent. More examples. More examples. Si no puede levantar la manita, de un solo abre el micrófono. Go ahead. Tati. Uh -huh. Ah, Roberto. I am going to run. I am not going to work. I am not going to work. Very good. More examples. Participate, participate. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I am going to watch TV. Mm -hmm. oh my God. I am not going to sleep early. I am not going to sleep early. Yes, I am going to watch TV. Excellent job. I need two more volunteers. Necesito dos voluntarios más. Tatiana. Uh, there are there they are going to watch the movie. Uh -huh. I they aren't not eat. They breakfast. are not. They are not going to eat breakfast. Very good job. They are not going to eat breakfast. Final volunteer. I am going to the work. I am going I to am work. Not, and I I am not going to the vacation. I am, okay. I am going to the work. I am not going on vacation, right? I am not going on vacations. That's very sad. Okay. So that is the form, right? That is the form of affirmatives and negatives. And so for sure, a in this case, when you use going to, you are using activities that are going to happen in the future, right? If you have, for example, general actions, it's like she reads a book every day. Esto pasa todos los días. No es algo que ella vaya a hacer. So in simple present, she reads a book. But in future, she is going to read a book, okay? Ella lo va a hacer en el futuro. He swims very well. This is a general action. Él nada muy bien. But if I say he is going to swim tomorrow, that it's another action that is going to happen in the future. They watch a movie at Cinemark. This is something that happens regularly. Eso es algo que pasa normalmente. But if I say they are going to watch a movie, it's an action that is going to happen in the future. Okay? So uh, that is the use of this one. I have here a sample picture. What do you think they are going to do? ¿Qué creen ustedes que van a hacer ellos? What do you think they are going to do? According to the picture that you have here, what do you think they are going to do? Here you have Michelle, Kevin, Robert, mm -hmm. and Jane. Mm -hmm. Write, write mm -hmm. in your notebook. Escríbalo en su cuaderno. Michelle is going to, Kevin is going to, Robert is going to, and Jane is going to. What are they going to do? Guess. Guess what they are going to do. Okay, I need you to guess. Write your best guesses about what they are going to do. ¿Qué van a hacer ellos? Inventense qué van a hacer. And I am going to call the attendance meanwhile. Mientras ustedes se inventan las oraciones, I am going to call the attendance. Ana Isela. Present teacher. Thank you. Ana Ruth. Present. Brian Francisco. Mr. Brian. Brian, where are you? <laughs> thank you. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Jorge, do you have a question? No, right. Ah, okay. <laughs> Carlo Ernesto. Present. Cynthia Marisol. Present. David Alejandro. Here. Thank you. David Rafael. Present. Diana Beatriz. Present. Diego Rodrigo. Present. Eric Javier. Present. Fatima Maidin. 
Present teacher. Jorge Francisco. Present. Josué Abel. Present teacher. Juana Margarita. Juana Margarita is there. Catherine Jamilet. Present teacher. Laura Lisette. Present teacher. Lorena Araceli. Present teacher. Mirna Yasmin. Present. Oscar Otoniel. Present. Reina Yael. Here. Roberto Carlos. Present teacher. Sandra Beatriz. Present. Uh, Sebastiana Guadalupe. Present. Tatiana Abigail. Present. Adriana Burgos. And Wendy Lisset Hernández. Present. Ok, solo por Adrianita no tuvimos la perfect attendance. Pero mañana vamos a estar todos completos. Ok, so tell me your best guests. What do you think they are going to do? What do you think they are going to do? Uh -huh. um, Michelle, Michelle, she's going to the gym. Michelle is going to the gym. Uh -huh. Una de Michelle. Eh... Teacher, yo no puedo ver la imagen y no me acuerdo de los nombres. Okay, right now, right now. Ahorita vuelvo. Okay, veamos. There we go. Se lo puedo volver a compartir. Para, tal vez el problema es ese. And I will share it again. Se lo puedo volver a compartir. Here we go. Michelle, Kevin, Robert, and Jane. Jane is going to the party. Jane is going to the party. Okay. <laughs> what about the other ones? ¿Qué tal los otros? ¿Qué van a hacer los otros? Robert, Robert Jane is going to the rap. Uh -huh. Okay. Jane is going to, <laughs> to listen. <laughs> they are going to go home. What about the rest? Jane is going to the shopping. He's going to the job, okay? He's going to go shopping. Well, he's, he's going, going to, the, to the, the work. Hey, he's going to work, okay. Kevin going to row. Oh, Kevin is going to run, okay, good. Kevin is going to the go dancing. He's going to go dancing. <laughs> good, good examples, good ideas. Probably is going to ask for job. He's going to ask for a job. He's looking for a job, right? He's looking for a job. Michelle goes to the gym with okay. some friends. And she's going to the gym with some friends. Nice, nice ideas. What else? Give me more examples, more examples. Jane, Jane is going to the discotheque. Okay, she's going to the discotheque. Okay, that's a good guest. He, Kevin is going, going to listen music. He is going to listen music. Okay, let's see. Kevin is going to play video games. He is going to play video games. Okay, I think that's a good guess, right? She is going to do aerobics. She is going to do aerobics. Good. She is going to do aerobics. Let's see what happens. Let me find the listening for me to play. Give me a second. Okay. Repeat, please. Okay, please. let me just, give me just a second. Deme un segundito, le voy a poner el audio para ver. Okay. Para que ustedes vean qué es lo que van a hacer. Qué es lo que cada uno iba a hacer. Okay, I think it's this one. And here I go. Let me change. Give me a second. Okay, let's see. Let me share my audio with all of you, okay? Déjenme compartirles el audio también. And here I go. I have the picture, good, and I am going to share the audio. Here we go. And listen. Listen to the audio.
Can you listen? Pueden escucharlo? No. No. No, no teacher. Okay, let me see. Here and vamos a ver ahora. The interview. What are the people really going to do? No? Yes, teacher. Okay, listen. Yes. Complete the chart. Good evening. I'm Al Rivers with KXQ News Radio. I'm talking with people waiting for the bus tonight. I'm finding out how they're going to spend their evening. What's your name? Michelle. I think you're going to go to the gym tonight. No, not tonight. I'm going to meet a friend. We're going to run together in the park. And what's your name? Kevin. Are you going home now, Kevin? No, not right now. First, I'm going to my friend's house. He has some new video games. Oh, I see. So you're going to play video games this evening. Yeah, I am. Can I ask your name? Sure. My name's Robert. Are you going to do anything interesting tonight? Well, my friend Chris is going to have a party, but I'm going to work at home. I have all my work right here in my briefcase. So you can't go to the party. You're going to work tonight. That's right. And what's your name? I'm Jackie. Do you have any plans for this evening? It's my sister's birthday tomorrow, so I'm going to bake a cake tonight. That's nice of you. Are you going to give her a party? Not really, but she's going to come over for dinner tomorrow night. Okay, so you see, appearances are difficult. I am going to play it again. Se lo voy a poner de nuevo para que puedan tomar notas, okay? Go ahead. Size 5. Listening. <laughs> Evening plans. Part B. Take notes. Listen to the interview. What are the people really going to do? Complete the chart. Good evening. I'm Al Rivers with KXQ News Radio. I'm talking with people waiting for the bus tonight. I'm finding out how they're going to spend their evening. What's your name? Michelle. I think you're going to go to the gym tonight. No, not tonight. I'm going to meet a friend. We're going to run together in the park. And what's your name? Kevin. Are you going home now, Kevin? No, not right now. First, I'm going to my friend's house. He has some new video games. Oh, I see. So you're going to play video games this evening. Yeah, I am. Can I ask your name? Sure. My name's Robert. Are you going to do anything interesting tonight? Well, my friend Chris is going to have a party, but I'm going to work at home. I have all my work right here in my briefcase. So you can't go to the party. You're going to work tonight. That's right. And what's your name? I'm Jackie. Do you have any plans for this evening? It's my sister's birthday tomorrow, so I'm going to bake a cake tonight. That's nice of you. Are you going to give her a party? Not really, but she's going to come over for dinner tomorrow night. Okay, so what are the people going to do? What about Michelle? What is she really going to do? She is going, to, is meet going to meet a friend. Meet she's a friend. going to meet a friend, right? And your guess, she's going to go to the gym. She's going to run. No, she's going to a party. <laughs> what about Kevin? Kevin is going to, go He's to, going to play game. video games with He's going to his friends. Play video games with his friends, right? And maybe listen to music, right? What about Robert? Robert is going to work. He's going at home. to work at home. He's going to work at home. And where is he not going to go? Okay. No. What about Robert? Robert, Robert, he's not going to go to the party, he's right? He's not going to go to the party. party. And Jane? Jane is going he's to going listen to music. She's going to bake a cake. Bake a cake. Bake a cake. Right? She is going to bake a cake for who is the one celebrating the birthday? Her sister. Her sister, right? She is going to bake a cake. 
and she's going to make a dinner, right? And she's going to bake a cake. Okay, so my dear students, for tomorrow, we're going to talk about holidays. We are going to talk about holidays in El Salvador. So if you have good ideas about different days that we celebrate here, bring them, okay? Si ustedes saben de, de algún festivo que no sea común, pero que se celebra, traiga la info, okay? Hay día de la naranja. Uh, that's new. That's so nice. Festival del Jocote. Uh, yeah, el Festival del Jocote. When is it? Right? For example, Yo the pupusa. Es el día de la pupusa. Yeah, the pupusa. Day. We have many different holidays. So if you have more, bring them to class tomorrow. Okay? Si saben de algún otro, traigan la info mañana. Have a wonderful night, and I'm going to see you tomorrow, my dear students, for another class. Bye bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Have a beautiful Bye -bye. night. Bye -bye. Sleep well, Bye -bye. I am going to sleep. <laughs> nice sleep. Nice sleep. <laughs>